Who are you? <gasps> Let me water you. Hey. Oops. Hello, oh, it's nice to meet you. Okay. You paid a good time to live here. The spring is lovely. So, this is when we live. She's the closest to my own sweetheart that I've found so far. The future isn't set in stone. Whatever would you believe can still be changed. If you set your heart on it, farewell. What about Leo? You really like Leo. Sam and Prince Stardew Valley. I just barely caught it in time to catch this, but Leah is telling me about her ex who she's just shouting on the phone at. Um, we did odd jobs during the day and spent all night working in art projects. We barely made enough to scrape by. He was always nagging me to go back to school and study business or medicine. Put a lot of money in it. Because the idea was to save up for a normal life. You know, house in the suburbs, kids, PTA meetings, that sort of thing. I wasn't ready for that kind of life glitch. I had to leave. So I came here to pursue my dream of being an artist. I'm glad you did, Leah. That's selfish of me. No, it had to be done. He was suffocating you. You're right. I just wouldn't have been happy back there. It was better for both of us to end an unsustainable relationship where we were still young and flexible. Anyway, I've been thinking a little more about that art sh idea, that art show idea you had. I'm working on some new sculptures to display at the show. I'm nervous, but the thought of getting my work out there seems is pretty exciting. I'm just glad you're on board with making Stardew Valley a premier art destination, Glitch. Of course. My actual, my actual partner is an artist. Let's see, so I have to decorate for the different seasons. Hi. I honestly just came here to give you the flower. It's a really nice gift, thank you! <laughs> That's like the whole reason I came over here, so have a nice day! Anyway, I just wanted to share that since I am pursuing Leah now, I thought I should show you, you know, all her little character bits, so... I'll probably push these all together into one long video, make it really cool. Thanks for watching! Glad to see you here. Will you dance with me? She will, she will dance with me. All right, Lewis. Hi. All right, Lewis. Someone actually will dance with me. Yeah, let's start. Now, do I have to push anything to participate? I can't remember what I did last time. There I am. I don't seem to be very good at dancing. I'm just like. <laughs> oh! Greta! Look! Please look at this, my beautiful taco queen. Oh, Leo! Hey, Glitch! Beautiful day, isn't it? Are you a gift? It's a sculpture I've been working on just for you. Oh! Oh, it's so cool! You received Leah's sculpture! It's called How I Feel About Glitch. I hope you like it. I thought it was gonna be called Small Intestine, though, honestly. Because. Oh, it's so cute! It's so cute. There we go. It's in my room.
go. Fletch, you're here. Okay. I guess I better introduce my pieces. Wish me luck. I'm about to run out of time. It's not fair. Um, okay, everyone. Thanks for coming to my art show. As some of you know, I came to this town because I wanted to draw inspiration from the beautiful surroundings. This place really feels like home now. Okay, I'm going to introduce my sculptures now. I haven't named this one yet. It started as an exercise in human anatomy, but I ended up seeing her through to completion. Her expression is intentionally unclear. Is she embarrassed, amused, pain? I'll leave that for you to decide. This one's called Post-Dimensional Null Space. It represents a boundary of human imagination. The shape and color came to me vividly when I was in a trance state. I'm calling this one Eggheads. I wanted to create an animatronic humanoid statue to toy with the viewer's ability to properly attribute personhood to a physical entity. That is so cool! And the last one is called Wood Sculpture 3. It's a celebration of my favorite sculpting material, wood. I have one of her sculptures in my house! It was called What I Think of Glitch, and it looked like twisted intestines. But I love it! Well, those are my scriptures. Sculptures. Oh, one last thing! I'd like to say thanks to my special friend, Glitch. He gave me the idea for this show and the courage to go through with it. I know that sounds cheesy, but it's true. I love this music. It sounds sad. I'm proud of you, Leah. Events like this really breathe life into our little town. I love your art, Leah. Post-dimensional null space is my favorite. Use a bird. Thanks for doing this. Oh my gosh, her face! Thanks, everyone. Now let's start the bidding on these wonderful pieces. Marvelous addition to your home. Do I hear 5,000 G going for the pink one? Oh, who's that crabby dude? Is that her ex? I'd like to kick him up the arse. Mostly because I'm protective of everyone I love. But yeah, if I could just kick him. Leah, where are you? Oh, hi, Emily. I don't want to talk to you at all. <laughs> Exhausted. My show was a real success, wasn't it? You bet it was. I have something for you. Uh, I accept this. Thank you. And now you felt the same. Oh, I'm so happy! Oh my gosh! Leah, I'm a friend. I gotta show you 